Hello, and welcome back to Making the Hot Tag. Yay. Yay, I'm Deirdre. I am Brendan. And we don't have any guests today, which is, I'm feeling okay about, because I'm like in the room in the bed. It, it's good. It's good to be able to stretch out and yeah. enjoy. Yeah, not that we don't like our guests, but... Um, and today we're drinking, it looks like mud, but it is not mud. What is it we're drinking? It's just called chocolate fudge cake. I can't imagine anything I want to drink more than chocolate fudge cake. So Thanks let's too. give it a taste. Ready? Cheers. Cheers. It smells like fudge. Mmm. <laughs> wow. Okay, so not sure if you've ever taken a piece of chocolate cake and put it in a blender, but pretty much that, that's this. Is this. Are you, you comfortable? Yeah. No, just butt do you, scooching. Do you need another pillow? No, I'm good. Okay. All right. And we have popcorn today. We're having popcorn today. Keeping it simple. Mm-hmm. So what are we watching today? So we're heading back up to Maine. Okay. Doing a tag match. Ooh, a tag match. A hot tag um, match. So we have... <laughs> You're already so, laughing. Well, I no. So I don't know I, what that means. The, so... The, the tag team we see right now, mm -hmm. at the time of this recording, they were called LAX. Okay. For Latin America Exchange. Okay. I know them as E-F-Y-B-O. All right, that's ridiculous. That's too long of a... So you'll go with LAX? I'll probably call them something completely different, so <laughs> I'm so going to go with whatever I feel like going with. So uh, they're, they're a really hot tag team right now. They're going to main event a pay-per-view later on tonight. Mm-hmm. Um, and they are wrestling uh, two people, one uh, gentleman by the name of J.T. Dunn. I'm going to use the word gentleman loosely. <laughs> and another gentleman of uh, named Brody King. Brody King? Brody King. You can see him in the corner there. He's tattooed to high heavens. Okay, so Brody to me is a name like like Brad and Chad and Chip and Skip and so Trip that's, and... So, it's, so is it a level up or down from Kevin? Well, no, Kevin like fixes your furnace. But, like, Brody wears salmon shorts and a whale belt on... Oh, you're going to be... Gonna right. I'm just saying the name, right? <laughs> so I can already see from the, the glimpse that he doesn't fit that. Mm -mm. Um, but that's like a, you know, as my daughter would say, a Chad and Brad name. Okay. Makes All right. Sense. All right. Oh, I'm going to start it. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, okay, let's right, go. Turn All it right. on. Okay. All right, try not to... You hold on to the popcorn? Yep. Okay. Three, two, one, play. All right. All right. So we're starting off with, it looks like they're playing that game, Chicken, chicken. You Play in Your in your Pool. Ah. Oh, I like his hair. That, that's an awesome hairstyle. That is so much fun. I kind of want to touch it, but I know that's not right to want to, like, touch other people's hair. But I mean, if I let my hair grow out, that's kind of what it would look like. But you would let me touch your hair. Yes, I would. Is somebody got a man bun too? Yes. Oh, because that I want to clip off. I have a whole well, thing I don't about think it's so... like the array of men's hair. It's not so much a man bun, but a high pony. A high hair. pony. I still want to cut it off. Oh, so the the manager mm -hmm. of Brody King and JT Dunn is uh -huh. uh, MJF from a couple weeks ago. Oh. With the really tight shorts. Right, right, right. Interesting. Small world. All right, does he have, like, Captain America sleeves on? Uh, the Puerto Rican flag. Um, oh. <laughs> they look like Captain American sleeves. They do. They do. I'm rooting for him. I'm rooting for him. I like his hair. I like his sleeves. I'm all in. And is he against the guy in the ponytail? Is he in the office? Yes. Okay, then I'm definitely yes. rooting for him because high pony. Yeah, I don't like. It's high pony and super tattooed man versus the other two. I like that Brendan now talks about wrestlers the way I do. Well, because instead of the other way around, like he hasn't rubbed off on me, and I've started calling them the right names. I've rubbed off on him, and he calls them the wrong names. This is good. This is a real progression of our show. It is. I like it though. <laughs> He's got a bubble butt too. Pony Here's man. A, pony just does. He's got like a high and tight booty on a hook. <laughs> we call that booty on a hook. Booty on a hook. Oh, combat roll right into Ooh, it. Ooh, I like it. So he's um, uh, Great Hair's partner right yes, there, right? The correct. one that did the roll in. The one with the khaki ish. Mm, he looks like he's wearing, um, what are they called? Compression stockings. Okay. <laughs> like you wear on a plane so you don't have to On his sleeve? Pots. 
No, on his on his legs. Oh, okay. Underneath the. Oh, right. Yep, I see. It's like when my mom flies <laughs> to Florida. Sorry, mom. Speaking of moms, hi, Brendan's mom. There it is. Hey, uh-huh. mom. By the way, while we're watching this fabulousness, we should tell our viewers that our 48-hour film won the audience award. We are so freaking awesome, and we'll see if we win the whole thing. We'll let you know. But thank you to our fans, the audience. Everybody came out and voted, and we are so excited about that, including Brendan's mom. And I had to guide her throughout that process of voting. Well, you know, that's because there were computers involved, and... It is not our parents' jobs to know how to use computers. No, I was happy to do it. Right. You don't worry, Brendan's mom. I get you back. <laughs> Grab him by the pony. Grab him by the pony. Look, he stands like a girl, too. That's a terrible anti-feminist that, thing yeah, I that was, said. That, that was, was kind wrong. Of, that was I apologize. Kind of out of nowhere. I apologize. But did you see how he was? Yeah. He was standing sort of prancy, oh, wow. if you know what I mean. I'm very politically incorrect in this Whole thing. Yeah, this kind of brings out a I know. different it's side. Not normally, normally I'm teaching people how to be politically correct. Big part of what I do. By the way, another plug, my, my website is up and running, face2facepro.com. Ooh, that was a boot to the head. Oh, dramatic fall from Ponytail Boy. Yeah. Nice. I have a little more respect for him because that was a, a very ballet-like, <laughs> graceful, swan-like graceful dive. Graceful fall. Uh-huh. So, uh, thoughts on venue? Oh, I love the venue. Okay, so so let me describe what I think the venue looks like. So this is not a VFW hall because it's got the fancy lights. But it is the cheesiest banquet room of like a... Oh, I love the double, the double pose. That was really good. <laughs> Sorry. Um, it looks like the banquet room of like a... Quint, what, what's that hotel? Quin, oh, Quintana, Quint, yep. or Quintana Inn, or Quintana Inn, round, or Round Tree Inn, or something. Right, or like Red Roof Inn. Looks like their one fancy room that they have. Right, it looks like that. So it's got like cheesy wallpaper and cheesy lamps, chandelier lamps, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. and the lights, Christmas. the Christmas lights <laughs> all year round on the pools. Uh huh. For twinkly magic. Ooh. Now that seemed like a dirty move. What's with this like pose that's happening? They're all doing it. Yeah. Well, it, it's uh, LAX's like signature it's pose. It's a signature pose. So he was taunting him. Taunting oh, him with I it. see. I got the better review. Now. That was an amazingly athletic flip considering these are larger men. Yes. All right. This is fun. This is just the... Oh, well, that's dumb. <laughs> Every time I'm about to compliment... Oh, but that was good. They've got that perfect mixture. Oh, that's silly. Damn and the shaking legs. Um, but they have the perfect mix of the gymnastic and actually still fighting as well. Mm-hmm. Oh, did he just kick somebody in the audience? No, he, tri- he tripped uh, Big Hair Guy Oh, okay. while he was running the ropes. And we're outside the ring. Who's the guy with the sling? It's MJF. Oh, he's the manager, yes. right? Oh, okay, I didn't recognize him out of his tidy wearing wearing clothes. Right. Uh huh. <laughs> I thought he was just a random audience member with a sling. Oh, okay. Oh, there's <laughs> that was a series of head butts and elbow butts and ooh, everybody's going home with a concussion tonight. <laughs> Concussions all around. Too early. So, interesting how all of these guys are fairly big. Even the smallest one, which I think is Ponytail, yeah. dude, yeah. are like big dudes. Yes, they are. And the acrobatic nature of their moves is quite impressive. Like all four, all the way around. Oh, yeah. No, when I was watching this, and I didn't... I hate jinxing it, but I really, I, when I was watching this, I was thinking the same thing you were. It's a, it's a very just straightforward wrestling match. Yeah. Well rounded. Mm-hmm. Well rounded, because sometimes when it's too straightforward wrestling, it's all fighting and it's none of the, but like the flips and the things, but they, I can't see most of the time the accommodation. Yep. 
I, I've seen maybe two of them. So what I mean by that is like the fakeness, like what they're doing to make it not so bad. It just like I know intellectually that they're being careful and yeah. and but I I don't see it and I like when I don't see it. You know. Right. Well, I want I've I've been meaning to showcase LAX for a while. We'll showcase show a match of theirs for a while. I just couldn't find a good one. And, and then I you saw the venue here, and you were like, "I was especially fond of the blinking light over the door." <laughs> yeah, for no reason. I've been staring at that too. It's like, what is that for? Ooh! Emergent slapped him so hard he dropped him. Well, he did it in his neck. That's vicious. And there's the blink. Now that's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, for him. What is it even? Is that a doorway? What is it on top of? It looks like a doorway or Either an elevator or, or a piece of furniture. Like what? <laughs> I want somebody to throw somebody through the chandelier. That looks dirty. Yeah, it did. That looked really dirty. Oh, big dumb face. Very expressive. I was getting pulled by the man bun. Well, that's what he gets for wearing a man bun. <laughs> that's the other thing. Why would you go into a wrestling match with a man bun? That's you, you might as well just give them a handle. <laughs> right? So... Boom! That was fun. Now that's somebody having fun with his moments. Yeah. Fun with his moments. Mm hmm Get him by the man bone. If you just heard Brody King say to Max Maxwell Jacob Freeman, you're gonna have to pay me. What where is this gonna end? Is he gonna twirl him? What is he oh Ow, that looks painful and dirty. That looks like what happened with Eleanor and the other dog. <laughs> Eleanor, my puppy, lost her virginity last week. It's very sad. She was in heat, in fairness. But I, I had to hear about it right after. We had to take them apart. But anyway, that's what that looked like. They were butt to butt, just like that. All right, that's probably too much information. Is that a Christmas tree? Yes. <laughs> so my guess is that this is around Christmas time. Uh-huh. I would like it better if it wasn't. That would make me laugh. <laughs> this was just like July. Yeah. There's a um, a bar in Nashville, Tennessee, if, if any of you guys go to Nashville, and it's called Santa's Pub. And it's like out in the middle of nowhere. Ooh. Ow. Wow. And it's a trailer, basically turned into a bar, and it's decorated for Christmas all year round. And you sing karaoke, and it's cash only, and it's only beer and malt um, products. It's super fun. You should go. Ooh. I haven't seen anybody tag anybody, by the way. They're just like, it, it just happened. It did not. <laughs> it literally just happened. All right, I was busy eating popcorn and talking about how nobody was tagging. Yeah, but prior to that, it didn't happen, right? I don't think so. Everybody's just wandering higgly-piggly wherever they want. I mean, this is something you should have picked up from, like, the second match we ever saw. I know. I want to see what tattoo dude's panties look like when they're off him. Like, they must be giant. <laughs> You're probably right. Like, you could probably pitch a tent and, like, do an overnight in them. Not just because he's a fairly big dude. I don't just mean that. But they, like, come up. Like, he's wearing... Like, look at the difference between where Ponytail Boys go. Right, the placement. Right. And where his goes. Mm. Mm. Is it just me, or do those shorts look like they don't belong in a wrestling ring? Actually, I don't. Even my favorite guys, they look like cargo shorts. They look like 1980s, or 1990s dads. Oh, yeah. Cargo shorts. Yes. I still like cargo shorts, but they're not really in style. <laughs> Ooh. I've never seen that before. Yeah, that's a unique way to choke someone. Yeah, that was uh -oh. new. He's in trouble. Oh, oh, oh evil oh. MJF. Oh, there's a lot going on right now. Oh, kick him when he's down. Boot to the head. Well, his partner's not somewhere. Who knows where he is? Oh, he was chasing MJF or out of the Oh, well, as one does. Now they're like acting tired and old, wandering around. Well, they've been yeah. wrestling for 10 minutes. It's their job. You know, like, 
Get on it. <laughs> Be better. What does Melania say? Be best. <laughs> Be best. Because we all should be listening to Melania. Uh oh. What? Getting big hair angry. Oh, his hair is getting bigger by the minute. Oh, 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 oh. Yikes. Wee! Uh oh, that's his partner. His man buns out. Here comes big hair. Oh, he looks like a, like a crazy caveman. Doesn't he? I think that was. I think. I that, like it. That's the scope of his look. I like it. I like when he comes running in. The hair like bobbles around. Yeah. Mm. Mm hmm. Do si do. Ooh. Uh oh. He didn't decapitate him. Look at the two of them. They look like crazy people. <laughs> Oh my god. It's like, is that all you got? Oh, he's taking off uh, the take, sleeve. Wow. And Extra power. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> that backfired. Oh. They're dancing Group. all around the maple. Whoa, holy shit. Holy shit. <laughs> and it's the amazing tumbling Torinos. <laughs> I mean, when you're 6'7", 270, yeah. this is, holy shit. Well, that's what I mean by, like, they're, they're, <clears throat> if you look just at the choreography of their scene, it looks like one of the um, Japanese groups. Okay. Right? right. Am I getting that right? The, ja the, yeah. the, the, the group that we saw in the fancy, the, weren't yes. they all Japanese? Yes. And they were extremely athletic and yeah. very... Um, just flying all over the place. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. It's like seeing, but they were little, all right. and more like gymnasts. And it's weird to see that type of gymnastic. I'm gonna sneak. Uh -oh. <laughs> she does it a couple of times, so bear with us. <laughs> Multiple sneezes. It's allergy season. What can I say? But it's weird to see the big guys do the same acrobatic right. stuff. Well. It when they know they can do it, they pick their spots to make it more right. impressive. Because, like, like you said, with that Japanese match, they were constantly. Yeah. Like, it was. It was. Yeah. Full throttle the whole time. Right. No fighting, just flipping. Right. That's why I like this one. It's got both. Right. And it's not just con like it's Ooh. they're not focused on one style. They're right. flowing into different styles. Right. This is fun. Uh, uh, it's like, like a Russian <laughs> dance thing. Like. We. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> Need to the so there's no way that they came up with this today. Do you know what I mean? Like, we were talking before about people who aren't used to wrestling with each other. They just kind of like plan well, out. Plan like, if out, I do yeah. this, you do this. But th this looks like people who have really worked together before. Probably. I mean, some of that stuff is really dangerous if you get it wrong. <laughs> Using another person. Using your teammate. To body slam somebody else. That is fun. I'm trying to pay attention so I don't miss who wins this time. <laughs> okay, wait, I didn't last time. There was one. Last you time. missed. Well, you missed the tag. So hopefully that. that... Right. Come on. Boom, boom, boom. Is somebody a good guy? Can somebody the bad guy in this? Uh, big hair and khakis are the good guys. They're the good guys? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Well, so... It, oh, yeah, I, I guess, because tattoo dude. I mean, also by wow. association, tattoo guy and man bunner with MJF. Okay. And MJF is He's just a, a bad, bad guy, guy wherever he goes. Right. Wow. <laughs> Holy crap. Huge Impressed by the power bomb? Yeah, I'm thinking the people who came to this match got their money's worth for sure. Although nobody's end up in the audience yet. That I've seen at least. Well, they kind of the when, they were running around, but like they didn't end up in the audience's lap, which I like to have it. Look at how giant. Those yeah, he's, pants he's are. oh the pants. Yeah. Yes. 
I mean, you could probably fit like five of man buns into the well, right, five don't you is think? an obscure number, but yeah. I like five. That's <laughs> a good number. Ooh. I mean, I like man buns tights because it's Carnage from mm. Spider Man. Oh, and I that, missed that, that, that reference. That's my comic book that's reference right. of the day. Mm. Ooh, boot to the head by surprise. Well, these announcers are freaking out right now. Well, we're freaking out. It's a good match. I feel like that cargo pocket on the other side, though, is just asking for somebody to rip it. (laughs) (laughs) What? You just taunt him right right in his face. do do Ooh. That was smooth. Oh, boot and to the boot head. to the head. Big boot to the head. Ooh. Double boot to the head. Wow. I I wouldn't think he'd Holy be... Holy shit. They are getting so much air. Yeah. He is flying. Yeah. That's Ooh. crazy. Superman flight. I, I didn't miss it. No, that was it. But it was very anticlimactic. It felt. Well, they they hit their finisher, so. Yeah, still, you know, <laughs> considering this was such a wild and woolly match, I feel like the end should have been more spectacular. I, he looks I like a you, rooster, sir. by the way. Yeah, his hair is very bad. It's bad. Is what it is. It's like it's he. It's almost like a mohawk, but it's still curly. Mm. So I think we've been doing this long enough, Brendan, that I officially have a preference. That? Right. Like, this is... Just a well-rounded... Just a well-rounded... I want to see people beat the crap out of each other. I want to see some flipping. I want to see gymnastics and the ability to fight. Yeah, I'm I'm a fan of this one. This one goes right up to the top of the list. I Good. don't know if it, I'd have to think about it if it's the very top, but... Um, big fan. Definitely top three, top five. Yeah, top three. I would even say definitely in the top three. Nice. Um, so it's been an amazing week. Uh, seen my favorite or one of my favorite wrestling matches. We've won the audience award for the 48-hour film festival. And we my have another, website we is... Have a, we have another film ready to go. Yes, we have another another film that's in the global competition. And we're waiting to hear about that. And uh, we'll be posting them all as we do. And uh, yeah, and comes to my new website, face2, the number two, facepro.com, face to facepro.com. It'll be up here. It'll be here somewhere, like here. <laughs> um, and on that note, I am Deirdre. I am Brendan. And we'll see you next week. Bye. Bye.